Pittman. Hi, Nick Burchell with ADP. Hi, I'm Nargis Sharifi. Nice to meet you, Nargis. Can I take a seat? Yeah, of course. Right, thank you. So how are you doing today, Ms. Sharifi? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Um, so I'm going to make this quick. I know you have limited time. Um, I understand you have a frozen yogurt business called Froger. Could you tell me some about that? Yeah, um, I actually opened up uh, the business a few years back. Mm -hmm. um, I just wanted to have a place where people can go and enjoy quality frozen yogurt while hanging out. Okay, that sounds really awesome. And so um, I was reading up on Froger Online. I understand you do monthly contests for your customers. Can you tell me about that? Yeah, so um, each month I allow customers to um, tell us their creative ideas for potential flavors that they'd like for us to serve. Um, I pick one of those ideas and I make the frozen yogurt and I serve it for a temporary time period. And if it does really well during that time, I'll serve it as a permanent flavor. That sounds amazing. So your customers are basically a really important growing factor for your business. Yes, of course. Um, and that's part of the reason why I do the monthly contest. Okay, sure. So um, how many different locations do you have right now? Um, as of now, I have three. You have three. Are you planning on expanding from that? Yeah, I'm actually in the midst of opening up my fourth. Okay, so um, how many employees do you have at the three existing locations? Um, I have about six employees at each location. Six at each, so you have like about 18 employees? Yes. And how many are full-time, how many are part-time? Um, I have about two full-time managers at each, at each location. Um, I have two part-time uh, part employees and then two full-time employees. Okay, cool. And so do you have like an opening date for your fourth location yet? Yeah, I'm hoping I can open it up within the next few weeks. Okay, that's really exciting. Um, and so for the new location, do you know how many employees you're going to have there yet? Um, well, hopefully just about the exact number that I have at my other locations. Mm -hmm. But right now I'm having to shift um, some of those employees to this location, to the new location, mm -hmm. um, just until I can get some permanent employees. Okay, so well, I can tell that your job keeps you busy. Um, how much, so how do you manage payroll for all your employees? So um, the managers write down these schedules um, for the employees mm -hmm. and when they've worked, and then I will go in to each location and um, put the information into the computers. Okay, well that sounds kind of time consuming. So um, let me ask you this, how often are your employees paid? Is it like once a week or every two weeks? Weekly. It's weekly? Okay, and so each week, how, how much time do you spend doing your payroll? Um, I would say about five hours. Five hours. Okay, so you know, 52 weeks in a year, um, five hours a week, that's about 260 hours in an entire year that you're spending doing on payroll. So what if I were to tell you that with ADP, you could save yourself those 260 hours in your whole year and put that time towards, you know, other important aspects of your business? I mean, that sounds good um, that I'll be saving time, but um, it sounds like I'll be spending money instead, and that's something that I kind of want to stay away from, especially since I'm opening up the fourth location. Right, so you just you want to be able to save your money. Um, I understand that, but you know, spending money to help further grow your business is really an investment, and it helps you out, actually, in the long run. And so, also, the time you're saving from doing your payroll is time you could potentially be spending at your new location, which is opening up. I mean, when you say it like that, it definitely puts it into a new perspective for me. Okay, and so, you know, we talked about how saving time and money was important to you. What other concerns do you have for your business? Um, well, because I have employees traveling to the new location, it's hard to keep track of when they're actually on the job. Right, so being able to keep an accurate log of your employees' hours mm -hmm. would be benefit beneficial to you? Yes. Okay, um, and so I just want to make sure I'm understanding you. So are you saying having a payroll system that has the capability to be mobile would be helpful for you? Um, yes, because I would actually like to um, compensate them while they're driving to locations too. Sure. So that's okay. something that I could be interested in potentially. Okay, well I'm glad you brought that up actually because with ADP we offer an app that you can download onto any smartphone device. Mm -hmm. um, it allows employees to clock in and out from their cell phone and um, it also is super secure. You don't have to worry about important um, information being leaked or anything. Employees can check their W-2 tax forms. They can also see all the benefits you um, provide for them with your company. And then um, they submit their timesheets from there and then you actually are able to view everything easily. 
Wow, um, I mean, that sounds good, but I feel like learning a new system is time consuming mm -hmm. and requires patience, and that's something that I have very little. <laughs> yeah, right. I totally understand. And in most cases, I actually would agree with you. Um, the great thing about our app is that it's so user friendly. It's a little bit crazy. If you have any problems with it at all, we also have a 24 seven tech support staff that's on wait for you. All you have to do is call it and be able to help you with any um, errors or, or any problems you might be having with it. And then I'm also going to leave you with my number. So worst case scenario, if the tech support can't help you. I'll be able to talk you through any problems you have. And actually, if you don't mind, I would love to be able to show you just a little quick demo of how the app works right now. Yeah, that's okay. good. So perfect. So um, all you do is create your username and password with us. Okay. Log in through here. Once you're logged in, you can check W, employees check W-2 tax forms here. Okay. Benefits over here. Clocking in and out is right here. Okay. And then this is where you come in and you can see all of the um, clocking in and out timesheets that they have. It's 100% easy to access. Wow, and that's for all the employees? For all of them, exactly. Oh, wow. Right, yeah, so. Uh, um, that definitely looks a lot easier than I was um, than I was anticipating. Right, yeah, so. okay. I'm glad to hear you say that. Yeah, it's, su it's super easy to use. Can make your life as a business owner much that much more efficient. Um, and so, you know, just based on the fact that uh, everything we've talked about that ADP can offer you, um, and I know it can help you save time and money, which is really important to you right now, um, do you think that maybe you're interested in going forward with ADP from here? Um, I mean, I think uh, I think my company could definitely benefit from it. Mm -hmm. So um, I would be happy to uh, set up another appointment and, and maybe we can go from there and figure something out for for us to do some business together. All right. Well, that would be awesome. I'm actually looking forward to our next meeting then. Well, thank you so much for coming in. Of course. Thank you. Thanks. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Come in. Hi, I'm Narga Shirky with ADP. Hi, Nick Brochelle. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. Please take a seat. Thank you. Yeah. Awesome. I see you're a big Harry Potter fan. Yes, um, I'm actually rereading the last book right now. Definitely one of my favorite series. I can I can uh, relate. I'm a huge fan myself. Um, I must say that the books are much better than the movies. Um, I know that time is very limited to you, so I, I don't want to take much of it. Uh, so why don't you tell me a little bit about your restaurant, Pizza Dia? Yeah, for sure. So um, at Pizza Dia, we specialize in only serving pizza and quesadillas. And we try to offer as many different kinds as we can for our customers. So what makes your restaurant different? So we only use the best ingredients for our food. Everything is organic and everything is grown locally. That's great. So how long have you been in the business? Had it for about five years now. Wow. Um, and then is this the only location? No, I've got two actually. Oh, okay, great. Um, and so how many employees do you have at each location? So at each one I have eight. Okay, and um, that's about 16 total. So um, how many of them are part-time versus full-time? Okay, so let's see. I've got two full-time managers, four full-time employees, and then two part-time employees for each restaurant. Okay, and um, how do you manage payroll for all of your employees? Well, so right now I do everything myself. I just ask that my managers keep a track of when my employees clock in and out. And then at the end of each week, they give me that information and I go ahead and enter it manually into the computer. Wow, and how long does that normally take you? Oh, uh, gosh, I would say roughly about six hours a week, maybe. Wow, that sounds very time consuming. I know that in the um, restaurant industry, time is very important. Mm. So uh, how would you feel if I told you that with ADP, you could save those six hours and put it towards something you enjoy doing? Well, you know, in theory, that sounds great, sure, but um, at this point, I'm kind of accustomed to the way I've been doing my payroll because I've been doing it for so long, so I'm hesitant to change it, um, and I'm kind of cautious to think about the time it would take to learn a new system also. So let me understand you correctly. Um, it's learning a new system that's a concern of yours. Um, yeah, I'm not very tech savvy, so uh, it's kind of intimidating to think about picking up those new skills. 
Um, I, I can totally understand. So how would you feel if I assured you that with ADP, one doesn't have to be skilled in that field in order to use our services? Well, that sounds comforting, but I'd really like to see it for myself. Sure, I could definitely show you a quick demo in a few minutes. Mm -hmm. But before we get to that, besides the learning factor, um, what are some other concerns you have in regards to your business? Well, actually, I have intentions of opening up um, delivery services for the restaurant in the future. Oh, okay. Um, and so are you expecting your employees to keep a handwritten log of um, the time that they've left for delivery and the time they've come back? Well, so far, yes, I have considered that to be one option. Um, realistically, I do know that it's not the most accurate way to keep track of things. And so at this point, I haven't actually decided on what I'm going to do yet. Well, Mr. Bruchel, I'm glad you've expressed this concern um, because I wanted to let you know that with ADP, not only do we offer payroll services, um, we also have a mobile app and that could definitely help solve this need of yours. Really? That's interesting. Yes. Um, and if you don't mind, I would love to show you how user-friendly the app really is. Yeah, I'd really like to see that. Okay, so um, first you need to create a user ID and password mm -hmm. um, with ADP, and then you download the app onto your phone or any mobile device. Um, and then when you log in, being an, uh, being an owner, you have the ability to view both what an employee would see and what an employer would see. Mm -hmm. So. Um, Looking at it in the employee view, in the bottom left corner, um, this is where the employee would clock in and out. In the top right corner, they have the list of benefits. Mm -hmm. And then in the um, middle of the screen, there's an icon where they can view their current time cards. Being an employer, you have the ability to um, approve their current time cards. And then you can also see if they've had any late clock-ins or any absences, that way to just to make sure that you're compensating them correctly. Okay, yeah, that's cool. So it seems like that would actually help me out with my delivery driver's hours. And you're right, it does look really user-friendly, so I'm glad to see that. Yes, it is very easy to navigate. Um, and just to recap everything we've discussed, I wanna make sure I understand correctly um, that your concerns include the time you're spending um, doing your payroll, and then an objection you had um, about regarding switching systems was your inexperience with technology. Mm -hmm. I've just shown you how user-friendly the app really is. Um, we also found a potential solution to your concern um, regarding tracking your delivery um, driver's hours through that ADP mobile app. So uh, would you say all of that is accurate? Yeah, so I think you've, we have covered all of that and you're definitely right. Time is super important when you're trying to work in the restaurant industry. And so anytime I could have more time during the day is definitely a good thing. And I am really pleased with the fact that the technology looks user friendly. So I'm very glad to hear that. Um, and just to assure you again, if you have any problems um, in the future with the technology aspect, we have a tech support staff available to you at all times and I will be happy to give you my direct phone number so you can contact me with any questions or concerns you have in the future. Okay, that sounds good. It sounds like my business could definitely benefit from working with ADP. Um, but at this point, you know, we've gone over a lot of things. I'd like to take some time to just um, consider the options that we have talked about. And then um, maybe we could set up another appointment in the future from there. But um, I just want to thank you so much for coming in today. Thank you so much for meeting with me. And I hope to hear from you soon. Thank you. Thank you.